A viceroy is an official who runs a country, colony, city, province, or sub-national state, in the name of and as the representative of the monarch of the territory. The term derives from the Latin prefix vice, meaning, in the place of, and the French word roi, meaning, king. A viceroy's territory may be called a viceroyalty, though this term is not always applied. The adjective form is viceregal, less often viceroyal. The term vicereign is sometimes used to indicate a female viceroy suo jury, although viceroy can serve as a gender-neutral term. Vicereign is more commonly used to indicate a viceroy's wife. Viceroy is a form of royal appointment rather than noble rank. An individual viceroy often also held a noble title, however, such as Louis Mountbatten, 1st Earl Mountbatten of Burma who was also viceroy of India. Spanish Empire The title was originally used by the Crown of Aragon, where beginning in the 14th century, it referred to the Spanish governors of Sardinia and Corsica. After the unification, at the end of the 15th century, later kings of Spain came to appoint numerous viceroys to rule over various parts of the increasingly vast Spanish Empire in Europe, the Americas, and overseas elsewhere. In Spanish-ruled Europe In Europe, until the 18th century, the Habsburg crown appointed viceroys of Aragon, Valencia, Catalonia, Navarre, Portugal, Sardinia, Sicily, and Naples. With the ascension of the House of Bourbon to the Spanish throne, the historic Aragonese viceroyalties were replaced by new captaincies general. At the end of War of the Spanish Succession, the Spanish monarchy was shorn of its Italian possessions. These Italian territories, however, continued to have viceroys under their new rulers for some time. Sardinia would have a viceroy until 1848. See also List of Spanish viceroys of Aragon, List of Spanish viceroys of Valencia, List of Spanish viceroys of Catalonia, List of Spanish viceroys of Navarre, List of Spanish viceroys of Sardinia, List of Spanish viceroys of Sicily. List of Spanish Viceroys of Naples In the Americas The Americas were incorporated into the Crown of Castile. With the Spanish colonization of the Americas, the institution of Viceroys was adapted to govern the highly populated and wealthy regions of the North Overseas, New Spain Mexico and, Philippines, and the South Overseas, Peru and South America. The viceroys of these two areas had oversight over the other provinces, with most of the North American, Central American, Caribbean and East Indian areas supervised by the viceroy in Mexico City and the South American ones by the viceroy in Lima, with the exception of most of today's Venezuela, which was overseen by the High Court, or Audiencia of Santo Domingo on the island of Hispaniola for most of the colonial period. These large administrative territories became known as viceroyalties Spanish term, virenatos. There were only two new world viceroyalties until the 18th century, when the new Bourbon dynasty established two additional viceroyalties to promote economic growth and new settlements on South America. New viceroyalties were created for New Granada in 1717 capital, Bogota, and the Rio de la Plata in 1776 capital, Buenos Aires. The viceroyalties of the Spanish Americas and the Spanish East Indies were subdivided into smaller, autonomous units, the Audiencias tribunal with the authority to judge, and the Captaincies General military districts, which in most cases became the bases for the independent countries of modern Hispanic America. These units gathered the local provinces which could be governed by either a crown official, a corregidor sometimes alcalde mayor, or by a cabildo or town council. Audiencias primarily functioned as superior judicial tribunals, but unlike their European counterparts, the New World Audiencias were granted by law both administrative and legislative powers. Captaincies general were primarily military districts set up in areas with a risk of foreign or Indian attack, but the captains general were usually given political powers over the provinces under their command. Because the long distances to the viceregal capital would hamper effective communication, both Audiencias and Captains General were authorized to communicate directly with the Crown through the Council of the Indies. The Bourbon reforms introduced the new office of the Intendant, which was appointed directly by the Crown and had broad fiscal and administrative powers in political and military issues. See also Viceroyalty of the Indies 1492 
Viceroyalty of New Spain 1535 to 1821 List of Viceroys of New Spain Viceroyalty of Peru 1542 to 1824 List of Viceroys of Peru Viceroyalty of New Granada 1717 to 1819 List of Viceroys of New Granada Viceroyalty of the Rio de la Plata 1776 to 1814 List of Viceroys of the Rio de la Plata Topic. Portuguese Empire Topic. India The title of Viceroy being awarded to members of the nobility, viceroys, governors and governing commissions were many times interleaved until the last Viceroy Afonso, Prince Royal of Portugal, in 1896. From 1505 to 1896 Portuguese India, the name, India and the official name Estado da India State of India including all Portuguese possessions in the Indian Ocean from southern Africa to southeast Asia and Australasia until 1752 was governed either by a viceroy Portuguese vice rei or governor from its headquarters in Goa since 1510 The government started 6 years after the discovery of sea route to India by Vasco da Gama in 1505 under first viceroy Francisco de Almeida B 1450d.1510 Initially, King Manuel I of Portugal tried a power distribution with three governors in different areas of jurisdiction, a government covering the area and possessions in East Africa, Arabian Peninsula and Persian Gulf, overseeing up Cambay Gujarat, a second one ruling the possessions in India Hindustan and Ceylon, and a third one from Malacca to the Far East. However the post was centered by Governor Afonso de Albuquerque 1509 who became plenipotentiary, and remained so. The duration in office was usually three years, possibly longer, given the power represented. Of the 34 governors of India in the 16th century, only six had longer mandates. List of viceroys and colonial heads of Portuguese India, 1505 to 1961. Topic: Portugal. During some periods of the Iberian Union, between 1580 and 1640, the King of Spain, who was also King of Portugal, appointed viceroys to govern Portugal itself, as the king had multiple realms throughout Europe and delegated his powers to various viceroys. Brazil After the end of the Iberian Union in 1640, the governors of Brazil that were members of the Portuguese high nobility started to use the title of viceroy. Brazil became a permanent viceroyalty in 1763, when the capital of the state of Brazil, Estado do Brazil was transferred from Salvador to Rio de Janeiro. <laughs> British Empire <laughs> <laughs> British India. Following adoption of the Government of India Act 1858, which transferred control of India from the British East India Company to the British Crown, the Governor-General as representing the Crown became known as the Viceroy. The designation, Viceroy, although it was most frequently used in ordinary parlance, had no statutory authority, and was never employed by Parliament. Although the proclamation of 1858 announcing the assumption of the Government of India by the Crown referred to Lord Canning as first viceroy and governor-general." None of the warrants appointing his successors referred to them as viceroys, and the title, which was frequently used in warrants dealing with precedents and in public notifications, was basically one of ceremony used in connection with the state and social functions of the sovereign's representative. The Governor-General continued to be the sole representative of the Crown, and the Government of India continued to be vested in the Governor-General in Council. The Viceroys reported directly to the Secretary of State for India in London and were advised by the Council of India. They were largely unencumbered in the exercise of their authority and were among the most powerful men on earth in the Victorian and Edwardian eras, ruling over an entire subcontinent with a large military force at their disposal in the form of the British Indian Army. Under the terms of the Government of India Act 1919, viceroys shared some limited aspects of their authority with the Central Legislative Assembly, one of the first steps in the establishment of Indian Home Rule. 
This process was accelerated by the Government of India Act 1935 and ultimately led to the independence of India and Pakistan as dominions in 1947. Both countries finally severed complete ties with Britain when they became republics, India as a secular republic in 1950 and Pakistan as an Islamic republic in 1956. Alongside the Commander-in-Chief, India, the Viceroy was the public face of the British presence in India, attending to many ceremonial functions as well as political affairs. As the representative of the Emperors and Empresses of India, who were also the Kings and Queens of the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Ireland, the Viceroy served as the Grand Master of the two principal chivalric orders of British India, the Order of the Star of India and the Order of the Indian Empire. During the office's history, the Governors General of India were based in two cities, Calcutta during the 19th century and New Delhi during the 20th century. Additionally, whilst Calcutta was the capital of British India, the Viceroys spent the summer months at Simla. The two historic residences of the Viceroys still stand, the Viceroys House in New Delhi and Government House in Calcutta. They are used today as the official residences of the President of India and the Governor of West Bengal, respectively. The portraits of the Governors General still hang in a room on the ground floor of the Presidential Palace, one of the last vestiges of both the Viceroys and the British Raj. Notable Governors General of India include Warren Hastings, Lord Cornwallis, Lord Curzon, the Earl of Minto, Lord Kelmsford, and Lord Mountbatten. Lord Mountbatten served as the last Viceroy of British India, but continued on as the first Governor General of the Dominion of India. Ireland. The Lords Lieutenant of Ireland were often referred to as Viceroy after 1700 until 1922, even though the Kingdom of Ireland had been merged in 1801 into the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Ireland. <laughs> Commonwealth realms The term has occasionally been applied to the Governors General of the Commonwealth Realms, for example Gough Whitlam in 1973 told the Australian House of Representatives, the Governor General is the Viceroy of the Queen of Australia, the Governor General of Canada, the Lieutenant Governors of the Canadian Provinces and the Governors General of Australia and Governors of the Australian States are Viceroys in terms of the Balfour Declaration of 1926. The Australia Act 1986 also provide that all royal powers in Australia, except the actual appointment of the Governor-General and the Governors are exercisable by the Viceregal representatives. The noun Viceroy is rarely used but the adjective Viceregal is standard usage. <laughs> <laughs> Russian Empire Namusnik Russian, Namusnik Russian pronunciation, NMSNK, was an office position in the history of the Russian Empire. It can be translated as viceroy, deputy, lieutenant, the broader sense of that word, or literally in place appointee. The term has two periods of usage, with different meanings. Namusnik replaced the obsolete position of voivoda, ruler of Krai or Uyezd, by Peter I. In the 12th-16th centuries, Namistniks more correctly Nyas Namistniks, or Nyas deputies, were in charge of local administration. In particular, they ruled Uyades. In the 18th-20th centuries, a Namistnik was a person in charge of Namistnichestvo, with plenipotentiary powers. The latter has traditionally been translated as viceroyalty and Namistnik, as viceroy or vicegerent or, as a common blunder, viceregent. For example, Mikhail Vorontsov was Namistnik of Bessarabia 1823 to 44 and of the Caucasus 1844 to 1854. Sometimes the term is confused with Governor General, General Gubernator. For example, during Vorontsov's term of office in Bessarabia, seven Governor Generals were in, and at the same time he held the office of Governor General of New Russia. The following Namistnik existed under the Romanov Emperors of Russia, Kingdom of Poland, while in personal union under the Emperors of Russia as kings styled Tsar, the 20th of June 1815 to the 5th of November 1916, had only one Viceroy, the 9th of December 1815 to the 1st of December 1830, Grand Duke Konstantin Pavlovich Romanov, 1779 to 1831. 
Viceroyalty of the Caucasus, Transcaucasia Armenia, Azerbaijan and Georgia, first under governors in Tbilisi 1802–1844 had viceroys of Transcaucasia, the Tsar Paul I's 1799 formation of the Russian-American company obviated viceroys in the colonization of the northwestern New World. Other viceroyalties French colonies New France, in present Canada, after a single governor the 24th of July 1534 to the 15th of January 1541 Jacques Cartier had lieutenants general and viceroys the 15th of January 1541 to September 1543 Jean François de la Roquette, Sieur de Roberval, c. 1500 to 1560. After September 1543 to the 3rd of January 1578 abandonment again the 3rd of January 1578 to February. February 1606 Troilus de Mesquez, Marquis de la Roche Mesquez died 1606 Viceroy and from 12 January 1598, Lieutenant General, February 1606-1614 Jean de Biencourt, Sieur de Powderincourt, Baron de Saint-Just 1557-1615, next a series of Viceroys resident in France 8 October 1611-1672, later Governors and Governors-General. Italian colonies In Italian viceroy, the highest colonial representatives in the «Federation» of Italian East Africa six provinces, each under a governor, together Ethiopia, Eritrea and Italian Somaliland were no longer styled «High Commissioner» but «Viceroy and Governor General». From 5 May 1936, when Italian forces occupied Ethiopia, until 27 November 1941, when the last Italian administrator surrendered to the Allies. The Italian King Victor Emmanuel claimed the title of Emperor of Ethiopia, Nagusa Nagast, King of Kings, and declared himself to be a successor to the Nagusa Nagast, even though Emperor Haile Selassie I continued to hold this title while in exile, and resumed his actual, physical throne on 5 May 1941. On 7 April 1939, Italy invaded the Kingdom of Albania, today Albania. As Viceroy of Albania of Victor Emmanuel III of Italy were the Marchese Francesco Giacomoni di San Savino and after his departure General Alberto Pariani. Topic. Ban of Bosnia Ban Boric was the first ruler and viceroy of Bosnia, appointed by Geza II of Hungary by 1154. His war affairs are documented as he fought several notable battles. He also maintained ties with Knights Templar and donated lands in Bosnia and Slavonia to their order. His own biological brother Dominic was on record as a Knight Templar. Topic. Ban of Croatia From the earliest medieval period in the Kingdom of Croatia, the position of viceroy was held by Ban of Croatia who acted as king's representative in Croatian lands and supreme commander of Croatian army. In the 18th century, Croatian bans eventually become chief government officials in Croatia. They were at the head of Ban's government, effectively the first prime ministers of Croatia. The last ban held his position until 1941 and the collapse of Yugoslavia in World War II. Topic: <inaudible> Ancient antecedents. An equivalent office called the Exarch was created in the Byzantine or Eastern Roman Empire towards the end of the 6th century for governors of important areas too far from the imperial capital of Constantinople to receive regular instruction or reinforcement. The chosen governors of these provinces were empowered to act in place of the monarch hence ex -arch with more discretion and autonomy than was granted other categories of governor. This was an extraordinary break from the centralized traditions of the Roman Empire and was an early example of the principle of viceroyalty. Non-Western counterparts As with many princely and administrative titles, viceroy is often used, generally and officially, to render somewhat equivalent titles and offices in non-Western cultures. Africa 
In cultures all over the continent of Africa, the role of viceroy has been subsumed into a hereditary noble as opposed to strictly administrative position. In the Arabo-Berber North, for example, the title of Khalifa is often used by individuals who derive their authority to rule from someone else in much the same way as a viceroy would. Elsewhere, subordinate Nkosis under the rule of a paramount chief like the king of the Zulu nation of southern Africa or subordinate Balas in the realms of the reigning Obas of West African Yorubaland continue to occupy statutorily recognized positions in the contemporary countries of South Africa and Nigeria as the customary representatives of their respective principles in the various areas that are under their immediate control. <laughs> Maratha Empire, India Marathas from the time of Shivaji sent various empire insiders to run foreign parts such as Tamil Nadu, Gujarat, Madhya Pradesh and Andhra Pradesh, where the Maratha Empire extended. <laughs> Ottoman Empire The Khedive of Egypt, especially during the reign of Muhammad Ali Pasha this officer established an almost autonomous regime in Egypt, which officially still was under Ottoman rule. Although Muhammad Ali, Muhammad Ali used different symbols to mark his independence from the Sublime Port, he never openly declared himself independent. Adopting the title of Viceroy was yet another way to walk the thin line between challenging the Sultan's power explicitly and respecting his jurisdiction. Muhammad Ali Pasha's grandson, Ismail Pasha, subsequently received the title of Khedive which was almost an equivalent to Viceroy. <inaudible> Vietnamese Empire The post of Tong Tran governor of all military provinces was a political post in the early period of the Vietnamese Nguyen dynasty 1802 from 1802, under the reign of Emperor Zha Long, there were two Tong Tran who administered Vietnam's northern part named Bac Tan with administrative center in Hanoi and the southern part Gia Dinh Tan with administrative center in Gia Dinh, while Nguyen emperors ruled only the central region Kin Kentucky from capital Phu Zan. Tong Tran is sometimes translated to English as Viceroy. In 1830, Emperor Min Mang abolished the post in order to increase the imperial direct ruling power in all over Vietnam. Topic. Chinese empires During the Han, Ming and Qing dynasties, there existed positions of viceroys having control over various provinces e.g., Liangguang topic. Guangdong and Guangxi, Huguang Hubei and Hunan topic. Siam In Siam before 1885, the title was used for the heir apparent or heir presumptive Thai, Kerm Frarachuang Burstan Mankal the title was abolished and replaced with that of the Crown Prince of Siam. See also Vicegerent Notes Sources Asnar, Daniel, Hanoden, Guillaume, May, Niels F. Dir, à la place du roi. Vice Roys, Governors et Ambassadors dans les Monarchies Françaises et Espagnoles. X -V -I -E -X -V Madrid, Casa de Velázquez, 2014. Elliot, J. H., Imperial Spain, 1469-1716. London, Edward Arnold, 1963. Fisher, Lillian Estelle. Viceregal Administration in the Spanish American Colonies. Berkeley, University of California Press, 1926. Harding, C. H., The Spanish Empire in America. New York, Oxford University Press, 1947. This article incorporates text from a publication now in the public domain, Brockhaus and Efren Encyclopedic Dictionary in Russian, 1906. Topic. Further reading Andrada undated. The Life of Dom John de Castro, the Fourth Viceroy of India. Jacinto Freire de Andrada. 
Translated into English by Peter Weich, 1664 Henry Harrington, New Exchange, London. Facsimile edition 1994 AES reprint, New Delhi. ISBN 81-206-0900-X In Russian Rano. Ru, Namusnik. 